I'm the bear. You see me find the grizzly bear. Help the bear, motherfucker. Like, that, that's what you do. Alright, where he at? That's some bullshit. That's some bullshit. We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what, 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pierce. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted off. Starving will be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. <coughs> here. You take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun. And we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn, I imagine. Come on, this way. It was a bit right. Yeah. Like Speed Johnson here. Got another video. I would greatly appreciate it if you would like and comment your favorite part of the video. How are you right. holding up, Charles? I'm okay. All right, I'm holding an X. We gonna match the speed. Mistake. Can we move faster. Though? It'll be nope. fine in a day or two. Okay. I just can't pull up. How are y'all dating? I sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. <sighs> so, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill that ain't an old Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Oh, watch it. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way, find some higher ground. All right, let's go do it. I'm with you, bro. Oh, I see it. Get down, Arthur. Wait, look. There they are. Get just a little bit Quick, closer. Get that bow out, Arthur. Oh. Uh -huh. Try to hit him in the neck or head. Quick and clean. Get good tension on the string before releasing. Just don't overdo it. Hit shot. Laid it down. Alright, that's one. Is there another one over here? Am I tripping? Or... Look at that. Right through the head. Right through the jaw. Beautiful. Is that one over there? I wish we moved just a little bit faster. Ah, I see it.
just wounded it. Better go put it out of its misery. Shit. You tell me a wounded deer still that fast? Come on now. See? Maybe I gotta get a little bit closer to her. Alright, let's get up, man. Damn. Sorry I had to do you like this, Bambi. I'm sorry. In my life. And my hunger is more important than your life, motherfucker. Man, the horse could have came a little bit closer, I'm like, damn. saw the video just freeze on my um back my capture are. device too. I don't appreciate that. Are you ready, bro? Come on then. Let's head back. Well we've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Watch out. Bear up ahead. Let's see if we can find another way around. He's got a lot of meat on him. We've got enough here. No need to push our luck. Must be real hungry. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. I mean, personally, I feel like I can beat the bear. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me get up off the horse. Hold up, bro. Hold up. Let me, let me. Hold up. Oh, hold up, hold up. I ain't no bitch, Charles. Hold up. Hold up. This is my, this is my YouTube channel. I ain't no damn bear gonna scare me. Get, let me get the rifle out. Hold on. Hold on. Man, I, I'm the bear. You see me find the grizzly bear. Help the bear, motherfucker. Like, that, that's what you do. Alright, where he at? That's some bullshit. That's some bullshit. Alright. We're back now. That was that was some bullshit. I ain't appreciate that in the least bit. They ain't give me a chance. Motherfucker, like he was on my ass and I was dead in like three seconds. I ain't Easy. Come on. Get these over to Pearson. Let me get this damn deer off of here. Man, turn around, bro. I only showed you a little. There's a lifetime of practice to master. I appreciate that at all. Well, well, well. I'm gonna take the damn deer. What a surprise. I found a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid. He loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yes. Oh. Seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. We'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. I'll get to skin you. <coughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. Well, now all of a sudden you, you your hand burnt. You, you don't want to do nothing. Down the floor there. I'm just gonna strip Bambi butt booty ass naked, just live Not on YouTube. Too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town if you're looking to make the, the 
legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. Yeah. Well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. You just got Bambi and his cousin just sitting up there butt booty ass naked. There ain't no way to go out. Right, a few days later. It's been a bad few weeks. But Dutch being Dutch, he is busy making plans and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respects, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. Mm -hmm. You still here, then? I owe you. Yeah. And you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur. I think it's time for the train. You want me to come? Of course I do, but... Look at you. It's always <laughs> ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. Dutch. Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. He's seen me now. What's left of me? What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. <laughs> Bide your time. You'll see plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marcy. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now. Railway man. Bill, now you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah, come on. What do you want from me, Hosea? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now, suddenly we're about to rob a train. What choice have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutch. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? You know, he's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch. Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Let's do it. Get your horses ready. We have a train to rob. All right, look like we squatted up again. Let's go. Last time a bitch head got blown smooth off. I don't know why I'm no faster than this. We got this cowboy music running, but, but this is fast as we gonna go. Okay, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Let's move. Listen up, all of you. According to the information so kindly provided to us by the O'Driscolls, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're gonna pick it off after it crosses the border. Hey, bro, one more person got the guy. They all got one more person to bump me in this damn formation. Charles, you'll keep lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. But when it was time to skin deer, you weren't fine no more. When it was time to help with the bear, you wasn't fine. You was nowhere to be found, actually. Motherfucker. Still there? Yeah. You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. Well, I gotta do it. Whoa! Right, let's go check on Bill. How he doing with the explosives and such? How you getting on? Okay. You sure? Of course. Can I help a little? All right. Go ahead. 
and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Little detonator. Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and oh. then attach it to said detonator. All right. Shit, okay. teaching me how to set up dynamite and shit. All right, that should do it. You head back up to the others. I got it from here. All, All right. right, boy. Let's head back up there. <laughs> I'm so excited. Oh gosh. We'll soon find out. Everything okay? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. The train should be here any minute now. Uh, switch to the item wheel. Okay, that's how you put on your mask. All right. Gentlemen, it's time. Good luck, all of you. You all know what to do. It was fine. It was my fault. Come on! You're pathetic. You know that? Gosh. Alright, let's go. Can't even blow up the damn train off the track. Right, let's go. Here we go! Here we go. Ah! Ah! You gotta work on them landing, bro. Hey, down here! I see you, don't worry. Tap it now. Yeah, you're okay. Alright. Now, let's go slow this thing down. Let's go, my black brother. Where's Javier? Motherfucker, we don't know how to land. The others will get him. Probably should switch to a weapon. Oh, wait, wait. Ah, damn, I was about to say maybe I should. Itch. Bitch, lay it down. Who's got a shot on them? Ah! Uh! Shot his hat off. Fuck! How'd I miss again? Pop your little head out. Oh! Uh! Damn, he shot me. Damn, I was trying to hit his boyfriend right there. Alright. Bitch! Alright, let's go. Damn. Bitch. All right, let's go. Shouldn't we push up? You all right? Yeah, I'm good. I got these sons of bitches. Ah. Head down. Oh! How are you doing there? I'm okay. Doing all right. We're moving. Oh, we at the front of the train already. Look at that. Oh! Fucking hands off me, sir. This is the conductor. Beat his ass. Fake ass A blinking. What's up? I should have tossed his ass clear over there. Alright, let's go. Headshot. Mm, that's good shooting right there. there be some money at the end 
How did I miss that? Yes, sir. Let's go. Where the hell are you? I'm dead now. Let's go. Oh shit. Look, they're coming out of that last call. Oh. I thought we was done. We need to stop moving. Alright, let's get up here. Hey! Get the other board! It's a whole heap of bitches. Oh my lord. I don't know who is who. Okay, cool. It's all right. Oh, where's my hat? Wait. I don't know where it's at. Uh, ain't no point. Yes, let's get the money and go. We got some fellas holed up in this last car. Ah, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. But we will. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me. We will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We are opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. I'm a nose itch. Wake up. I ain't digging my nose itch. That's all y'all got for me. That's all y'all getting for me, bro. I ain't wasting no ammo on this. Just to complete that little objective on the top Mr. left. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. Sure. Now, don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems good enough. Here we go. Now light the fuse. Unless hey, bro. Wait, wait. Wish. I'd step back, fellas. I'll loot your pockets while we're waiting on that. Thank you, sir. All right, come on. Just walk on out. <laughs> I'll you. blow y'all motherfucking head off. I don't want to rob your boss. Get on up there. Search that train. <laughs> hey, bro, don't bump me again. Hey, bro, why are everybody bumping me, bro? What's that about? Look at this place. <laughs> it's like a palace. Well, now I've seen everything. Oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. <sighs> what this letter say? stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will you? I'm parched. Shut up. Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. Didn't see you rushing to jump on that train. He's keen. I'll give you that. Okay. I got a cigar. I'll take that. Can get this open. Platinum pocket watch. I'll gladly take that. Thank you. Getting there. Let's see what this letter saying. There. See? That's how it's done. Shit. Just a pile of papers. Bonds? I don't think so. Here. Make yourself useful. At least we all know you can read. <laughs> Give me those. Take some cigarettes. Railroad contracts. Ooh, In got me a little bit of money here. Blah blah blah. You got anything? Not really. A whole twenty-five dollars. I'm rich. West Indies. Alright. Anything else? Sugar? Some Fancy new boaties ordered from Europe. I'll take that cigar, thank you very much. I am not robbing another boat. Search the cabinet. Okay, and a damn thing in the cabinet. Alright. Have you checked all the drawers and cabinets? Oh wait. Got a lockbox in here. Come on. Let's hurry this along, boy. Okay. That looked to be what we want. I think I got him. Nice. Thank God. Come on. I'll take some of this as well. Thank you. What 
What did you find? These bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of here. What about them? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. All right. Oh, please no. Shut up. Stay down. Damn, how many bullets y'all gonna take? Alright, that's the end of that. Y'all have any money on y'all? Run that shit real quick, bro. Fifty nine cents, bro. I'm going to the front of the train. Who just casually got fifty nine cents on them? I know this is earlier times. 59 cents, you ain't even got a whole dollar on you. You guarding a train, you a criminal more than likely. 59 damn cents. You must think I'm a motherfucking fool. Alright, Out of this hellhole, we're gonna try. Weather seems stable, and we just robbed the Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets, the worst is behind us, gentlemen. So, the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there, no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. <laughs> well, then let's go clean noses Damn. and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Ring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. Get over here! Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me with the boy? Just go. Come on, bro. He got one more time. You can buy my me black brother. Call him a boy and shit. That's a grown ass man. Show him some respect. Now I got to do this. Whoa. What the fuck? Yep. I can't see shit. Go on. Why are we so far behind? Man, shut your ass up, Jose. I am holding X. Just as fast as we go. I'm trying, motherfucker. Gotta keep us moving, but calm. Alright, we out. Oh, oh damn! Oh. Okay. 
Let's take a look. Okay, that's part of the game. That ain't my fault. Does everything look all right? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, let's get it fixed. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. All right, Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a leg? Shut up. I'm just saying. Well, say less. Mm -hmm. Pick the wheel up. All right. Nearly there. There we go. Now it's good and on now. See, you ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. What do you think? If they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. Not too far now. Stay on this trail. We'll follow the river, then cut left inland. So, yes, the Indians in these parts got sold a very raw deal. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll see y'all when we get to Horseshoe Overlook. Ain't nobody trying to reason. go over how the white man they screwed over the Indians. Right. Or excuse me, Native Americans. Every blade of grass. Here we are, gentlemen. Home sweet home. This place is perfect. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were on to something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Hosea. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck east of the Grizzlies and out of money. And a, a long way from our dream of virgin land in the west. I know, my brother. But we are safe. We make a bit of money here. Then we move again. Head out around them. Be west of Uncle Sam. In a few months, buy some land. I hope so. Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen, I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. Up for robbing banks to usury? Seems more dignified somehow. Now, everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. I know that things have been tough, but we are safe now, and we are far too poor. Mm -hmm. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Uncle, Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> it is time. For everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named of Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. Can we put you over here? I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson! 
I've seen shit with more common sense than you do it properly. <laughs> damn. Alright, is that the end of this damn cutscene? Mission long as fuck. Well, not really. Well, eh, it's kind of my fault this video is this long. I thought I could fit in two missions. I didn't realize it was going to immediately have us move after the last, after the little train robbery. A couple of weeks later? Okay. Got off the mountain. Road east into some pretty enough country called the Heartlands. Ain't been this far east in many a year. Dutch seems a little better. His eyes are sparkling once more, and I can see he's thinking a little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier, in spite of black water and that whole mess. Hi there, Jose. Quite a day. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. Mm-hmm. <laughs> You get your book in. That's going to be the end of this episode. I'm probably going to record some more tonight, though. Like maybe two, three more if I can. Uh, yeah. See you in a minute. Oh, Arthur, my boy. Shut your ass up, Dutch. <laughs>